me anyway. So you know, it's a hotel review. So we've come to the Lord Alfred Hotel in Bang Chang. Not far from where we live, but uh, 40 minutes by taxi. It's cost me 450 baht, which is absolutely nothing at all. It's a good distance. It's about 50 kilometers, I think. Um, but it's, uh, <coughs> it's absolutely stunning. It's like a boutique hotel. I don't know how many rooms it's got. Two, three, four, eight, 12, 16, 30 ish, maybe. 35 rooms, maybe. But it's uh, pretty, 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 pretty good. My dress is lovely, spoke to her already. So let's uh, have a quick zip through. Uh, I will do a quick walk around the pool, Scottish Old Private Beach, as all good boutique hotels would do. So let's uh, go check it out. Okay, so, visit, nice looking room, big enough, not huge, but adequate. Probably 25 square meters, maybe. Using TV, uh, all the normal stuff, tea, coffee, etc, 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 a nice bathroom. The disappointing thing with the bathroom is it's not got a decent shower and it's not contained. It's one of these sort of wet room type things, which is the flushing loop. <coughs> Fridge, water, etc, etc, but of course we've got the view. Views cracking. So put down the coast. Down this way is Rayong. They get across to Kosamet uh, from Ban Pabia. They go all the way back this way. It's the other side of these mountains where we live is Tortia. It took us about 45 minutes to get here. So beach. It's actually a good time to come because it's a um, voting weekend. So there's nobody here. Very few guests. I think there's about so far about seven or eight rooms. It's pretty good. But nice to be upgraded to, uh, to a, a sea view. Always oh, lovely to be upgraded in this. Uh, manage, manage the for the girl, very good bell, very accommodating. Uh, her ATM, uh, not her ATM, her uh, PDQ machine wouldn't work. So she said, oh, just pay it before you go. So I, I walked down to the, the village just to pick up some money for the ATM, five minutes away. And it was just shot. There's a little tree going away from the top. I don't know if you can see that. Kind of into screen. Okay, so that's that. So watch along a flat pack here. Parking, not a huge amount of parking, but there's a car park across the road. I think you can probably get away with using it that one over there. So to the left hand side this reception. The box I sit with the customer, I don't want to stick my camera in his face. I'll do that a bit later. So coming through, mirror windows, control table of course. In the bar. I mean, why would you not want to work here? It's just absolutely idyllic. Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. So, pretty good. Views to die for. Yeah, this is absolutely beautiful. It's got its own beach. As you would expect from a small boutique hotel. The beach is customarily grubby and it's not been uh, it's not getting better over the years, I don't think. Still a bit grubby. Nobody cleans this bit of the beach. As you come from Bang Chang, we regularly go down to uh, the beach on a Sunday morning, clean up. But it's a bit of a shame, you know. It's only the downside of the sands. There is jump in beaches are much cleaner. So, pool, lovely pool. Very comfortable, cheers. Yeah, enough rooms. 16, 17, 18, 19, yeah, probably 40 rooms. Pretty good. Pool's 
smallish, big enough for four, four, four rooms. <coughs> some some beds, some dining area seats, which is good. So I'm certainly be having dinner here tonight. I won't be going far because it's uh, voting weekend, and what happens voting weekend? The bars are closed. So the restaurants are open, but apart from that. So on the cover, the Victory, Victory Cabana, very nice. All really nice. <coughs> Here up in front of the bar, so we'll get the sun in it. It was great, really good. What not to like? Even little cannon. Now that is a really, really nice feature. Little cannon. The Lord Nelson. Mm. And I've seen this everything many times, but I've never been there. And when I lived here, worked here, I don't think it was around. I'm not sure how long this has been going for, but it's uh, so impressive. Obviously, we've got the upstairs toilets, the pool area, which is great. I'll be paying a visit very soon. Uh, nice seating in the cabana. Yeah, it's good. So it's going to get dip very soon as well. So, okay, let's uh, knock that one on the head. You can see it's a, it's a really nice, nice ambience. Nice place up over here. I think they've got about six rooms booked in, which isn't a great deal. Need to see what pay the staff wages. Yeah, it's not cheap. This cost me two thousand uh, and fifty-six baht for the, for the night. Not cheap, but not over expensive. They say you're on the beach, and the bar is not an expensive. Seventy seventy baht for a, for a beer, and um, two eighty fish and chips. You know, Thai food. All about the sort of 200 mark, which is obviously more expensive than here on the street, but it doesn't matter. It's, uh, it's a treat. Okay, guys, if you any uh, enjoyment out of this, if you um, want to subscribe, give me a like, thumbs up. Don't like it, tell me. Tell me what you want. All right, until next time, thanks for watching. Take care and bye for now.